So we'll begin with the feet together, or as close as you can. The hands can come to the lower abdomen, just taking a few deep breaths in and out. As you breathe in, the belly expands, and as you breathe out, the belly returns toward the spine. Breathing in and breathing out, just arriving in the body, letting go of the worries and concerns of the day. Just coming into the here and now. This is your time. And then on the next inhale, if you want, you can hold the breath just for a moment. Then let it out with a big sigh. And then the hands float down. As you breathe in, the arms float back up to the sides. They circle in front as you gather in the energy. Bring it into the heart. Send it down through the body towards the earth, sinking the chi. Breathing in, gather. Breathing out, directing down to guide and direct. Feeling the sensations. One more time, sink the chi. This time, step one foot out to the side, either foot. The arms float up just to about shoulder height. The arms float down, the knees and hips soften. Breathing in, rising up like you're resting on a wave in the ocean. Breathing out, softening down. We call this opening the door, the start of the journey. One more time, rising up, softening down. This time the arms float out to the side, spreading your wings. The arms float down, the palms face up. They float up the midline, pressing up overhead, floating all the way out and down, holding up the sky. It's a great way to open the shoulders and open the chest. Nice gentle stretch, lengthening the spine, creating space, allowing the blood and energy to circulate throughout the body. One more time, holding up the sky. This time the hands float up to the heart. One hand pushes up, the other pushes down. Switching sides. Keeping the spine neutral at first. And then this time, if you want, you can do a side bend. Always easing in, just never forcing it. And then once more to the other side, connecting sky and earth. This time, bottom hand comes up, push to the corner, other hand pushes behind. Coming back to center, push to the other corner. The dragon spreads its wings. Nice and easy, gentle rotation back to the corner. Maybe a little more if you like. And then once more, the dragon spreads its wings. And then from here, the back hand swings around as if it's gliding on the surface of the water. The other hand comes around, the dragon swings its tail, sending little ripples out into the distance. You're coming right across the water. One more time. This time the hands come together. Prayer position. They float right across the eye level and across the heart. And then lower abdomen. The swimming dragon floating back up for another round. Drifting across, opening the wrists and shoulders. And then once more, then release. Round out, hug the tree. Draw the hands in towards the heart and push right out to the side. Coming back to center, push out to the other side. The dragon stretches its tail. This time as you push out to the side, you can tap the toe out the opposite way. Stepping back in, other side, tap the toe right out to the side. This time you can tap the toe in front like you're testing out the waters. Other side, tap the toes, right out in front. This time you can tap them behind, just going straight back. Other side, and you can keep going straight back, or if you want, this time you can cross diagonally behind. And then once more to the other side, the dragon stretches its tail. And then coming back to center, the hands face each other right in front of the heart. As you breathe in, the arms float up slightly. As you breathe out, the hands brush out to the sides. 
Coming back up. Breathing in, in front of the heart. Breathing out, cleansing the lungs. Clearing out old, stuck energy that's no longer serving you. Just letting it all go. Clearing it away. One more time, cleansing the lungs. And then this time, keep on going all the way around and hug the tree. And then step one foot out a little bit wider. From here, the fingertips dip down towards the earth. The hands come forward. They come all the way up and over and then down the center line of the body, digging in the garden. And as always, it doesn't matter how low you go. Just being kind to yourself. Most important thing. All right, once more, coming all the way up. And then this time, reverse direction. The hands float up, they go all the way out and down, and then back up the center as we harvest from the garden. Circling it around, softening, and then rising up. One more time. And then this time, round out as if you're hugging a big tree right in front. The arms open wide. This hand here scoops under the other one on top. So you embrace the moon. Then put on the heel, the toes point right out to the side. And then the moon orbits around the earth, circling it around, stirring the chi, sometimes called. Circulating the energy throughout the body. You might even start to feel a little tingling. And then reverse direction, circle it around. And if you don't feel it, that's okay too. But over time, start to tune in to the sensations you normally tune out. And then hug the tree, bring it back to center. From here, the arms open. Then this hand here scoops under the other one on top, embrace the moon, pivot on the heel, toes point out the other way. The moon orbits the earth, circling it around, breathing. And you can sigh out at any time, it's always encouraged. Then reverse direction, going the other way. Breathing, feeling the sensations. One more time. And then hug the tree, bring it back to center. Step the foot in a little bit closer. And then from here, the hands drawn towards the heart, step in. And then step out to the corner as you push forwards in space. Drawing back in. Pushing back out. Nice and easy, nice and slow, pushing the mountain. All right, one more time. Push. This time the hands draw in, the palms face towards each other. The hands go out to the corner, the palms face away from each other. They open, circling out and around, scooping under, back out to the corner, parting the clouds. Breathing in, opening, sending energy to the heart and lungs. This one helps to give the immune system a little boost as well. One more time, parting the clouds. And then from here, step the front foot in, the hands come back in towards the heart, shift the weight, step in, and then step out to the other corner as you push the mountain. Breathing in. Breathing out, no rush, nowhere to go. Can you be here now? One more time, the push. This time the palms face towards each other. The hands go out to the corner, the palms face away from each other. They open, circling out and around, scooping under, back out to the corner, parting the clouds. It's like you're almost swimming through water. Just feeling the air on your skin between the fingers. How mindful can you be? One more time. Parting the clouds. Very nice. And then from here, hug the tree, bring it back to center, and soften. The arms open up wide. And this hand here drops down, drifts over to the other side. The hands switch positions, and then they float across like clouds in the sky. When you get to the corner, the hands switch again. 
Wave hands like clouds, drifting across nice and easy, nice and slow, breathing. This time the top hand makes a hook, bottom hand comes up and then floats right across the horizon. The palm turns out, circle it back around, single whip. This time you can step in if you like, and then step out as the hand floats across. All right, one more time, single whip. Then release the hook, the hand drifts over, cloudy hands. Take your time stepping in, drift across, breathing. Letting go. This time top hand makes a hook, bottom hand comes up, and then floats all the way across the horizon, the palm turns out, circle it around, single whip. And then once again, if you want, you can step in. And then step out. One more time, single whip. Release the hook, the hand drifts over, cloudy hands. Take your time stepping in. <sighs> Breathing. Nice and soft, using only what you need. At right, this time, step in as you make a hook, and then step out, single whip. One more time, circle it around. And then this time, we'll reverse direction. So the hand comes up and over, presses down, scoops through, and then back up. The snake creeps through the grass. Once again, circling it around. And as always, it doesn't matter how low you go. It's all good. One more time, the snake creeps through the grass. And then this time, the hook floats up. The hand goes down the back, down the leg, and all the way through. Then the other hand comes up and over, scoops down the back, hinging from the hips. The dancing dragon, breathing in. Breathing out, one more time, scooping through. And then from here, this hand drops down and drifts over. Cloudy hands, stepping in, drift across. <sighs> Letting go. This time, step in as you make a hook. Step out, single whip. Taking your time, float across. Once more, breathing in, breathing out, and then reverse direction. The hand comes up and over, presses down, scoops through, and then back up. Circle it around again. The snake creeps through the grass. Circling it around nice and easy. Feeling into the body. One more time, the snake creeps down. And then from here, the back hook, hook uh, floats up, scoops down the back, and then all the way through, other side, coming up and over, hinging from the hips, coming through, the dancing dragon. This one makes a good dance move too. <laughs> And then release the hook, the hand drifts over, the hands become clouds, stepping in, drift across, <sighs> breathing, letting go, moving like nature, effortless ease, just let the energy do the work. Right, one more time, cloud hands. And then this time we'll reverse direction, making two loose fists and then drag the clouds across the sky. And then switch, bottom hand comes up, the other one comes down, storm clouds. Breathing in, breathing out. One more time. 
And then from here, the arms float all the way down. They drift up to shoulder height. Then over to the other side. And then from here, the palms face away. They drift right across the heart. And then back down. Floating up, drift across, painting on the canvas. All right, once more. This time the arms float all the way up and over like a big wave, opening the shoulders, coming back down, the chin circles. Once again, coming up and over, taking your time. One more. Still breathing. And then from here, reverse direction. The arms float up to shoulder height, palms face away. The hands drift across. Nice, gentle brush strokes. Going back up, drift across, painting on the canvas. One more time. This time, the arms float all the way up and over, just as much as you can. Once again, never forcing it, just easing it. One more time, chin circles. And then circle in front, hug the tree, and soften. From here, the hands turn. The bottom hand drops down, then toss away. The hand waves in, and then press forward right towards me, repulsing the monkey. Other side, toss away. The elbow bends, the hand comes into the center, Coming palm over palm, calming the monkey mind. One more time, repulsing the monkey. This time, toss it away, the other hand on top, and then step in. Both hands together, pushing down and waving in as you soften. Rising up, softening down, breathing in. <sighs> Breathing out. This time step out to the corner, and as you step out, the bottom hand brushes past the knee, top hand pushes to the corner, the top hand circles down, bottom hand circles up, coming back to the beginning, brush knee, and push. Circling it around just like a dance. You don't have to get perfect. One more time, brush knee, and push. And then from here, the bottom hand scoops up, palms face up. The hands draw in, circle the arms out and around, the backs of the hands face each other, and spiral the palms back up. Mama Bear gathers her cubs, <sighs> spiraling the energy throughout the body. One more time. Gather your cubs, bring them in. Step the front foot in as well. The hands draw in, then circle them all the way out and around. Hug the tree, <sighs> soften. And then this hand here drops down, toss away. Other hand on top, step in. Both hands together, pushing down, waving in as you soften down. And then rising back up. Just going in and out a few times. Once again, there's no rush at all. This time we'll step out to the corner. And as you step out, the bottom hand brushes past the knee, top hand pushes to the corner. Top hand floats down, bottom hand floats up. Weaving it all together, brush knee and push. Breathing in. <sighs> Breathing out. All right, once more, brush knee and push. And then the bottom hand scoops up, palms face up. The hands draw in, circle them out and around. Backs of the hands face each other. Spiral the palms back up. The mama bear gathers her cubs. Healing the sensations. 
How mindful can you be? Once more, Mama Bear gathers her cubs, step the front foot in, and then circle the arms all the way around, tug the tree, and soften. From here, the arms open up wide. This hand here scoops under, step in as you embrace the moon, then step out to the side. And as you step out, the bottom arm tosses the moon into the sky. The other hand floats down, and circle it back around, parting the wild horse's mane. Once again, taking your time, and don't worry about getting it perfect. Just keep on moving. All right, one more time. All right, this time we'll make two loose fists as you embrace the moon, and then rest your head on the pillow. The bottom arm pulls the covers up. The other hand comes down, and circle back around. Two loose fists, rest your head on the pillow, bottom arm comes up. One more time, the lazy monk rests his head on the pillow. All right, and then from here, sit back, drift across. Step in, embrace the moon, step out, parting the wild horse's mane. Bottom arm floats up, the other hand floats down. Circle it around again. Still breathing. All right, one more time. Parting the horse's mane. This time, making two loose fists, embrace the moon. Rest your head on the pillow. Pull up the covers. The lazy monk rests his head on the pillow. I promise I didn't make that up. So <laughs> it's a real thing. All right, one more time. Call it the Lazy Monk for short. And then sit back. The all the way around, the hands come together in prayer position in front of the heart. From here, as you breathe in, the arms open out to the sides, arcing out. And as you breathe out, the hands come back together in front of the heart. Breathe in, open. Breathing out, the heart opening breath. Do that one again, just opening gently, nice gentle stretch. One more time, the heart opening breath. <sighs> From here, the arms float down, they drift out to the sides, spreading your wings, and then step one foot in, coming on the ball of the foot. This time, the arms float out to the sides, like a beautiful bird, we call the crane. This time you can lift your leg if you like, right up in front, touching down as needed. And then the arms can float up and over just as much as you can without forcing it, stepping back down, other side, just the arms at first, the crane, breathing in, breathing out. This time you can lift your leg if you like, touching down as needed. And then the arms can float up and over just as much as you can. And then stepping down, this time the palms face up, one hand on top of the other. This hand here floats all the way up and over, and then down the center line of the body. Other side, breathe in as the hand floats up, breathing out, centering. Creating focus and clarity, creating presence, calming the heart, calming the mind once more, centering. This time, both arms float up and over just as much as you can. The hands float down as you soften the hips and knees. Circling in front, gather in the energy to transform into loving kindness, self-compassion, floating down. One more time, open the heart. Breathing in, breathing out. This time, making a diamond shape with the hands in front of the heart, and then press out, sending out all your loving kindness to the world. May all beings be free from suffering. May they be happy. May they be healthy. May they live with ease. 
And then turning your palms to face yourself, the hands come to the heart. May I be kind to myself. May I feel connected with all beings. May I love myself just as I am. Then the hands can float down to the lower abdomen. You can step your feet together or as close as you can. And close your eyes or keep a soft gaze, letting your body rock and sway ever so slightly. Bamboo in the wind. Just feeling all the sensations in the body that arise. Feel the sensations of the body breathing. And then bring your attention into your heart, creating an inner smile, expressing gratitude to yourself for being here today. And then if your eyes were closed, you can slowly open them. The hands can come together in front of the heart. We can finish with a bow. All right, thank you all so much join me for this Tai Chi flow for balance. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know how you're feeling in the chat.